Hey guys, um, I know I haven't posted a video in quite some time, so uh, I want to do a real quick one on my braid out. As you can see, I'm doing a braid out, and um, the what's different between this braid out and what I normally do is I usually put the little black rubber bands on the ends of my hair to, to keep them together. Um, you know these little black rubber bands that you get the get at the beauty supply store but I saw a video and a lady had um, knots at the end of her braids and I have been meaning to try this but my hair is just now starting to get to a length where I can do stuff like that um, I guess I should have saved one to show you guys how I knot it because you for me I pretty much had to start the knot way up here and then kind of like pull pull it down to the to the tip but anyway, the reason why I wanted to try it this way is because the lady that I saw, the the lady that, the video that I saw who did it, she was saying how the ends um, just look a little bit better. Now with the rubber bands, you know, just just braid it down to the tip and then put a rubber band so you, but you still have locks that are sticking straight down. So when you take your braid out, out, you still have the locks still sticking straight down and knotting them at the end will kind of curl them um, at the ends a little bit. So I'm hoping that will look really cute. Um, and plus rubber bands can pull your hair out. Um, you know, the, they don't have a lot of, uh, they don't have fabric on them. So it's just that rubber against your natural hair and it pulls out anybody's hair. So you know hopefully it, it will work for me and uh, I'll continue to do it this way but uh, just wanted to show you real quick on what it looks like now looking like silly but um yeah that's that and then in the morning I might just do a little quick 20 second um, view of what my hair looks like and uh, then I'm out the door so yeah, I'm trying to get back on the video thing. My computer had got sick for about two months, so I'm just now able to post my videos. I did want to post a video about all the products that I received from Talia Wajid. Um, I know it was like forever ago that I actually got them, but again, because my computer was down, I wasn't able to do anything. And I did make a video about that, but I'm still trying to figure out if I should post it or not. So, um... Yeah, and I can save all of the, I've used a couple of products from from um, what I received. And um, I guess I can make another video on those actual products. Like the, the video that I'm speaking of that I made before was just me getting the box, opening the box up, and showing everything that came in the box. And reading the description and what it's for. So uh, maybe my next video I'll, I'll actually talk about the products that I have put on my hair. So, um... Yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. Alright, if you have any questions, uh, comments, you know, whatever, whatever, hit me up. Alright, bye. Alright, so this is what it looks like after I have taken the braids out. And um, as you can see, the ends are nice and rounded out instead of um, straight down. So, I am really, I'm really impressed with this. So, um... I'm not sure how good you can see, but um, it came out really, really crinkly because I did smaller braids. I usually do bigger braids to get it over with, but I knew I wouldn't be able to uh, do the knots in at the ends if the braids were a little bit thicker. So I'm, I'm really, I'm really pleased with this. It's like really puffy and not puffy. Puffy is the wrong word. It has lots of body to it. Look at that. Yeah, I like it. So, um, yeah, I will be doing this again, uh, the, the knotting at the end of my braids. So, yeah, here's another quick look. Oh.